Well, we got another brand new wheat to try. And this is what my daughter wants to make a wood shop. And this is just all the stuff. And I threw in a couple of those real nice uh, four by sixes I made yesterday. And we're going to go down and uh, and change her uh, wood shop around there. So that's going to be real good. I was, I was thinking there. I do a lot of thinking. And... Uh, I better get on with it here. I'll just try like this. <clears throat> I was thinking. What was I thinking? Oh, God. Can't remember what I was thinking. It was really pointy at two. <laughs> oh, yeah. When I was telling Jordan, when I was <laughs> one of my best friends is this guy called Jordan up in Fair Harbor. And uh, I was telling him, yeah, I said, I'm, I said, I think I'm going to, I said, I think I'm going to build a boat. He says, he says, uh, God, it sure must be nice to have money, Scott. Now, you know what I said to him? I said, yeah, you know what? It it really is. <laughs> uh, yeah. So anyway, yeah, we're just going to make a big start. That's happening on Tuesday, taking that wood over here. I'm just going to sop as, as much wood as I can today. So blah, blah, blah. He's all seen that stuff. And uh, Wednesday, big boat flip. So that's going to be just... A real milestone. So uh, yes, yeah, all coming together, and we just uh, continue on trying and uh, and uh, boomity boom. That's Jason's boomity boom. I use everybody's. I got I got I got some of my own material too. <laughs> okay. Well, it's Tuesday, and uh, so we're going to go over and, uh, and help Brooke with her uh, little project here. Whatever my kids want, I drop whatever I'm doing, and I go and help them. Whatever it is. And I do the same thing for my wife. I'm very proud of that fact. And, and you know what? They'll do anything for me, too. A beautiful thing so just gonna get a few tools together here and uh, we'll see what happens next So if you just cut this. Yeah, but I need a line to go all the way up. Oh yeah, just do it that way. If you get really good at fabricating, you can really do it by eye. That's the true professionals. That's why I knew that but that boat guy was so good. Okay, great. Cool. <laughs> we have sawdust everywhere here. Why don't we do it up on here? I guess it's okay. Let's I can do it. Yeah, I'll sweep it later. Okay, so we'll uh it's close to the paper there, right? Do you want me to the board? Oh, yeah. Short. Oh, look at that, Brookie. Mm. Not bad, eh? Not bad at all. It'll be, it'll be like you're at the lunch. Yeah. Yeah. 
No. What? And our thing to sit here. Oh, sorry. Yeah, Not too bad. Okay, so I want my, like all the bar recycling stuff to be organized right here. Yep. Then our, then the workbench to be the rest of the way. Yep. And then shelves. Like up to the ceiling kind of thing, shelves? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's so, start with the big workbench here. Because the okay, I but I have to figure out where it's going to start how long it Oh, I see. So the workbench will start right here. Is that not really long enough for a workbench? Where's it going to end? Over here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's a nice workbench because we're going to build that. We're going to build you the nice yeah, okay. wheel around thing. Okay, so. Yeah, that's right a really here. nice workbench. You haven't got a choice. You need to do what you're doing, right? Okay. Okay, so. And you know where it ends down here, right? Why don't just put a mark there? Here, I'll do it right. Six feet, like that's a good yeah, that nice because there's walking space. Walking space, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll hold that down there. Okay, and then where do you think the shell should start? Right, right where that crack is. Right here? Yeah. Why not? Okay, so that's eight foot. So I'm going to mark it. I'll mark it up. So eight feet bench. Okay. Eight foot bench. Okay, there it is. What does that leave you with for shelf? Good, three, three feet. Well, we can build it all the way through. Yeah. So, yeah, three and a half feet. Well, why don't we do this? Why don't we have the bench go right through, and that's a shelf, and then that's we then we start the shelves in, and we, and we, and we sure. What we do is we'll just make a we'll make a bench, and then look at this minute, the shelves. and then we'll have one go up here, and boom, boom, boom. Okay, sure. So easy as easy as pie. Okay. So. Now we need now we need this whole measurement then. Wherever we put this mark. Let's see what can we see if we got a piece that will fit. We'll pick up your nice little bench. Right there. Okay. It's gonna go all the way through. I'm gonna have the biggest work that's going on. Stinking toothpaste. Not toothpaste. Measuring tape. Okay, or do I measure right to the thing? Yeah, I measure right to the thing, man. Go right up to the wall, maybe even. Just put it down for a ballpark on the on the floor. Right. Okay. Jesus. Okay, sorry. Okay. Okay, what's that measurement? Eleven six. Eleven six. Now let's take the short end of the tape measure there and add it to this. Eleven six. No, no, to the stud. To the stud. Just to the stud. Okay, come over here with your elbows. See, I don't know. To me, it's like here. Okay? Yeah, but I think it'd be nice to have it a little higher, right? Yeah. That's high. So then you can stand up straight. Okay. What do you think? Okay, let's see what that measurement is. Over here. I'll go over here. 43, 42, 41. Yeah, that's nice. We can always shorten it up. Yeah, so. No, that's nice. That's nice to work. Yeah, so but but cut the boards at like at thirty nine or something. Oh, I see. Well, I guess the first thing we gotta it's do. It's a two inch board. First thing we gotta do is then we'll just uh, we'll put something on the wall. Let's put a piece of wood on the wall. Okay. So the top of it is thirty nine. Just put a little mark right there, Kevin. Okay, I'm see. Right there and then make sure that board's level. Yeah, okay. You don't need to too much. Well, I'll just put it marker anyway, so when we're putting it up, we can put it to the top. We'll get some big. Grandpa will be able to uh, hook me in uh, like a, 
Oh, that's Another creepy. Plug. Perfect. It'd be awesome to have your plugs and stuff right here. Yeah. Maybe we can make, okay. Okay, so boy. Okay, we gotta figure something else to put it on the back there. I'll go and cut that, and then I gotta go and get the dance. The little things that I brought for us. 37 and three quarters. Let's just get them. Okay. And we'll check on the other side. Okay. See what it is. Okay, remember, 37 three quarters, yeah, remember. Hang on, we'll do that together. We should actually put a nano or something in the back so it doesn't fall down because it's hurting it. Here, let's get this attached right now. Look. Take pictures out of it and everything. Brooke and Dad did this. It's a huge success. Does that fit there, guys? Uh, yeah. 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 I like that because sometimes you get a uh, long on top. Let's see, it's older than that. Okay, I like it. Can you lift it up a little bit rather than down? Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, Tammy, turn it around. Yeah, let's do it on that. On that a little higher than that bullet there on 18. I'll bring this one. Have another piece in there. Yeah, for sure. Put it in there. See, you make the right cut. Oh, is it touching? Yeah. Here, try it. Have to keep trying. Here, we'll just cut a wedge. We'll cut a wedge and we'll put it at the top. Don't worry, I'll make a wedge right now. See what we can do is we'll just put that wedge in there. We'll try to get this leave it there. It's kind of neat, actually. This is the, like the handcrafted stuff. <laughs> huh? Here, you know what we can do? Yeah, just let me. Two seconds. Okay. Right, sorry. Oh yeah, that looks nice. I'll take the recoil out of it. Is that good enough? Well, that's, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Just put a nail on the top of it. There you go. Let's sit there. Let's sit there. Let's wait and hold. <laughs> Nicely done. Put it back so at least it's kind of like in line with the other one so it doesn't work. Oh, what a success! This is Brook, for Brook and Dad Day, number one. Wow. And we got all this wood all stacked up there. I was lucky enough to be able to give that to my girl. And uh, we're just going to go back to the mill and keep on. There's old Harper. Hey, Harper. She gets stuck up. Gen genetically modified dog. And they're the best dogs that you could ever imagine. Now, let me help you, Harper. I said he's going up the ladder. <laughs> Get a different ladder. Are you going to stand on? We can make it. Maybe. We said maybe. Maybe. We have another ladder. So we're just yeah. lazy. Oh yeah. oh yeah, oh yeah. Lazy works, looks nice. like. Nice. Yeah. Nice. And that looks perfect. Merry Thank Christmas. Cool. So we're going to watch it. I think the timer's on, but I'm not sure if it's just on the on. Isn't it pretty? I want to get on my project. Let's go. Come on. Oh, that'll work there. <laughs> no, no, thank you very much. Hey, uh, you know what? I, what happened is I got this toolbox in my five ton and, I, and it's on the passenger side and I forget it open all the time. So what I want to do is put a little switch in there and then have a light on my dash. So when it's open, the light's on. So I need well, a switch. So you, you need a door jam switch. <laughs> 
Really? You got like that's a thing, eh? Yeah. So when it opens up, if the door jam switch will mix. Yeah. Yeah. So it just then if you have a little light or whatever. Yeah. Ha, looks like my dad was right. The pile is slowly getting bigger. I rushed home and I made these four by fours at the end of the day today. And yesterday I made these nice, this is one nice fat cedar log right here. So I got my two inch and I got my one inch stuff right here. And then, uh, ho, 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 look at the lumber. And I found something out today. I, I put all my names on all my tools. And uh, on the way home from Brooks, I get home my stinking toolbox on my 510. I guess we forgot to close it. And my brand new power saw was just hanging on the edge when I stopped at the store there. And uh, anyway, I drove back, I looking in the ditch, everything else I got, I got back here and guess what? This young guy going to UFE calls me up. He says, oh, you must've lost your skill saw. He says, I got it. So I got it back, $350. Anyway, I said, I'll give you a hundred bucks. He says, no, I don't want anything. He says, I just want to, I just want to play it forward so so I get good karma. So, uh, yeah, it's just a neat little story there. And, uh, yeah, I'm just like, I just want to, uh, I just want to thank all, I really want to thank the people that, that, that like and share my video and uh, make comments. It's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it makes it worthwhile for me. I appreciate that. But anyway, uh, I guess that's all we get for one day. The boat guy, he's, he uh, didn't get quite finished, so we're going to do that Thursday. So it's another day of mill, mill, mill. <laughs> going to run out of room to put the wood here pretty soon, but yeah. Okay, well, that's the news.